How about a little throwback footage to start off this week's rival series, the 1986 clash of the Armada Tigers and the Almont Raiders. With a win, Almont would have forced a three-way tie with Armada and Brown City. Armada won the game 22-12, won the Southern Thumb outright to make their first ever playoff appearance. But this is the 2019 version. This is the BWAC Conference. 13 miles separate the two schools, Almont. The defending champs coming in hot, 5-0. Armada, 2-3, looking to bring the Raiders back down to earth. Tigers want nothing more than to put a damper on homecoming. Um, a lot of stuff this week has been how much similarities there are between Almont and Armada. You're 13 miles apart, played in, you know, 70 games or so tonight. Been in the league together since, I don't know, we started playing football. Both, both towns start with an A. Both towns have five letters. Uh, a lot of, lot of people here have family, have friends, whatever. My mom graduated from Armada. There are, there are a lot of similarities, both orange and black. But tonight, you guys are playing to go to the playoffs, guaranteed, for the 10th straight year in a row. You win this week, next week, you're playing for at least a share of a back-to-back -back league championship. You win that, the week after, you're playing for a back-to-back -back outright league championship. You win that one, the week after that, you're playing for back-to-back 9-0 regular seasons. That is where the differences are. The, it's, not, it's not how you're similar, it's how you're different. The Raiders of Alma. Fresh off a 42-0 shutout of Croswell Lexington. First quarter, handoff to Mason Smith. Huge hole, he'll go 48 yards, untouched. Raiders in early 7-0 advantage. The Raider D have held three of their five opponents to less than 100 yards total. Back with the ball on their own 15. Jack Popper gets the rock this time. Right side, 47-yard scamper before getting chopped down in Tiger territory. Next play, the Raiders, Josh Hellebuck going to the air. His favorite target, Colby Chapman. 38-yard pitch and catch for the TD. Two-point conversion successful, 15-0 first quarter. Alma gets the ball back in with seconds to go in the first quarter. Hellebuck drops, finds Chapman again. 20-yard score, Raiders up 22. After a muffed squib kick, Raiders take back over and three plays into the second quarter, strike again. This time, Jack Popper, he'll go up the sideline, lowers his shoulder, bullies his way into the end zone. Almont, a commanding 29 nil lead. Raider defense doesn't budge. Almont, offense back to work. Jackson Castillo takes the handoff up the middle, turns on the afterburners, nobody's gonna get him. 80 yards to the house. Hellebuck looking to add on, this time finding his tight end, Jackson Malcolm, the stiff arm, he finds Pater 27 yards out. Raiders up huge. 2004, the last time Armada able to beat the Raiders near the end of the half, Tigers going for it. Eric Ketting airs one out to Joshua Bowman. He out jumps his defender and he's in the clear. 59 yards, touchdown, Tigers on the board, but trailing big at the break. This is karma, life, world, whatever you want to say giving you the opportunity to learn that lesson. Things are not going in our favor the first half. And we can, we can go a couple different ways. You can be part of the solution, refocus and, and continue to battle and crawl your way back in inch by inch. Not one, hey, you're not gonna win this game one in one play. You're not gonna change, completely change the game, one, but you can crawl your way back little by little. Or you can say, ah, oh, we're done, we'll move on, we'll, we'll worry about everything else next week. Or, or you can have somebody else fix the problem. I, I don't want, I, I want the one where we're all fixing the problem. We're the solution. 
And let's do that part. We're the one that fixes the, fixes the problem. Not anybody else. We don't wait for somebody else to fix our problem. We don't wait for mom and dad to come fix it. We don't wait for the coach to fix it. You go fix your own problem. Yes, and you sir. do it playing your technique. You do it being disciplined in everything you do. You do it doing the right thing even when things aren't going your way. We talk about be disciplined people. It's doing the right thing even when things aren't going your way. It's doing what you need to do, what you're supposed to do, even when there's an easier cheating way to do it. Yes, you take a shortcut. You don't take shortcuts. Okay. You do the right thing every time. You do it the right way every time. We clear? Let's go. Let's go bounce second half and crawl our way back in this game. We clear? Hey, yeah, sit right down. 30 down three, 30 down three. One, two, three, tire. No scoring in the third quarter, so let's jump ahead to under a minute to go in the game. Raiders looking to close it out, but Charlie Koning wants in on the action. Give credit to Lucas Deloria and Noah Hovner for carrying out their fakes, fooling our camera guy, but Koning up the middle, 58 yards. Almont up 48 to seven. A lot of teams would have rolled over. Armada wasn't given up until the clock hit triple zero. Ketting hits Connor McKenzie, 25 yard score to give us our final. Almont 48, Armada 14. The Raiders take on Richmond next week, which ultimately will decide this year's Blue Water Area Conference champion. Oh yeah, it's all it's very important to jump on a team early. Last week we came out flat and we had to come out in the second half and put up points on them, but this this week we came out on them on top and that led to success. So, you know, we've been looking forward to the game. I got I got family in Armada, um, and you know we knew there was going to be a battle, but we came out, played all month football, and uh, we got the W. So, well, uh, we're kind of used to starting fast like that, but last week we kind of came out soft, and it was nice to come out and hit them in the face a little bit and play all month football, good and tough. So. Good.